Here at Creekside High School with four-star 2025 wide receiver Dylan Vickerson. Dylan, first off, take me through spring. What are some things that you feel like you've shown here in spring practice to the colleges that have come through? Um, just my big, how big I am, uh, my athleticism, uh, my range, like my vicinity, how I can catch balls that's not really nowhere near me. How I can just use my body to uh, be more dominant than the person in front of me. All around stuff like that. Yeah. Okay. So in the spring or in the summer, what are some visits you have planned? Uh, May 31st, I'm going to Tennessee. And then a couple weeks after that, I'm going to Ole Miss and Alabama. Gotcha. Yeah. What's the story behind your Tennessee offer? How'd you get it? Um, he texted me uh, on iMessage, and he was just like, we've, we've been evaluating you. We looked at you. We watched your film. He said, we're, we're happy to offer you a scholarship. And then he just called me, told me he wanted me to come up, do all that stuff. Gotcha. Yeah. Was that Coach Pope or? Uh, Coach Kelsey. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you. Coach. Yeah. Cool. And what's your impression been of Coach Kelsey? Um, I love him. I love what he does there. I love everything about him. I'm ready to get up there again. Yeah. So what are you looking forward to, like, living here in Atlanta? What have you heard about Tennessee or what do you think about it? Um, Nothing really. But growing up, that's been my dream school. So I've been, I kind of been, they've been ahead of the process of all the others. So I've been, I'm kind of ready for all that. Yeah. And what makes them like a dream school type of thing for you? Um, just being like growing up where I'm from. I'm from Miami, and I didn't really, I wasn't really a Miami fan, so I really had to, like, I had to. I found another team, and growing up, I just found them, and I've just been with them ever since, really. Do you have like a memory, or what's the moment you decided like Tennessee is a school that I want to cheer for or look at? Uh, when my dad played them, he was at uh, Michigan State, and I went to the game, and I was, I was just in the atmosphere. I was loving. So I was at Neyland, or. Uh, I think he played, who he played there? Was uh, it the stadium in Knoxville? Yeah, Tennessee gotcha. Stadium, yeah. Okay, yeah. and how old were you when you got to see that? Oh, I was like, my dad was in college, so I was like, when I was like five, six. Yeah, I was young. Okay, and it, it still stuck with you that much? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Gotcha. So when you see that when you're younger, and then this past season you see the success they had, yeah. what do you like about the offense, or what have you maybe noticed from what you've gotten to see? Um, I don't know. I like, you know, the way we scheme things. Uh, like, I don't know. I don't know. That's all. That's all. Right. That's all. Right. Gotcha. Um, so in terms of your overall process right now, when you're looking at schools, I know you're still early in the process, yeah. but what do you want in a school in the future? Um, just a school that, you know, can develop, can develop me all around as like not only a football player, but as a man in life after school and after football, because football don't last forever. So I just, you know, want a school that, you know, develops me as a man in my life, not only as a football player. So in terms of your recruitment, what was the moment where things really blew up for you and you became the big national guy now? Um, I say about about spring last year. Spring last year, I got Michigan State, and then every, all the others just started coming in. Yeah, and it's got even bigger this year. I got Tennessee, UAB, Missouri, everybody. It's all just been coming in. So I'm grateful. I'm blessed. Gotcha. But, uh, yeah. Okay. And how did Michigan State discover you? Uh, my dad worked there, and I went to uh, I went up there for a private workout with uh with Coach uh, Haywood, and I was just working out with him, him the receiver coach, and they, they just pulled the trigger. Gotcha. And in the future, what are some of your goals? Um, it's inside or outside of football? In football, I want to be a 1,000-yard receiver with, i say, about 13-plus touchdowns coming up this year. And um, out of school or out of out of football, I want to, I want to maintain, like, 3.8 GPA. I'm working on it, yeah. Okay. Well, awesome. Thank you for your time and Thank good you. luck. Thank you. Sweet. Good to see you. Good to see you.